Local news for Friday the 25th of September. Daylight Savings Weekend this weekend and a reminder from the Fire and Emergency New Zealand to check the smoke alarms uh, in your house and replace the batteries. The Wellington Chamber of Commerce has released its 2020 election report. Chamber Chief John Milford says the government's COVID response fund and shovel-ready project list has allocated $185 million of the $3 billion fund to Wellington and Wadarapa regions. This is a minuscule amount for the country's largest regional economy after Auckland. In an award first, the Xander MacDonald Award, Australasia's Agricultural Badge of Honour, have announced that they will crown two winners, one from each side of the Tasman for the 2021 award. Sam Vivian Greer, a 31-year-old farm consultant at Baker Ag in Masterton, is a finalist uh, in those awards, uh, and they will be announced in March next year. Money spent in Wadarapa is seen to be going really well, according to Wellington NZ figures. In the four weeks ended September 13, compared, uh, compared to the same period last year, Masterton is up nearly 8%, Carleton just over 6%, and South Wadarapa a whopping 21.7%. In sport, tomorrow's Hartley match between Wadarapa Bush and King Country will hold a very special significance. The teams playing for the Meads and Lahore Scrolls. Kickoff is at 5pm, with Wadarapa Bush Māori playing Marawatu and the curtain raiser at 3. For local news and sport, Kelda, I'm Brink Gear.